So I really wasn't planning on filming this type of video today, like a little vlog style video. Um, but I was planning to film a Gymshark haul today, which I think I'm going to do as soon as I get the package. It's about one o'clock in the afternoon on this lovely Tuesday. I'm actually off from work. Um, but I really just wanted to kind of film because I don't know. I just feel like filming. So basically, right now, I am planning to go to the gym. I only have that planned right now. But I actually, before I go to the gym, I have to go do something, which I'm going to explain right now. Um, so I think it was January 28th. I had blown out my back during a squatting session at the gym and so I have no health insurance unfortunately I am part-time at max so they don't offer um, health benefits for part-timers and so I don't even have like health insurance whatever I left I left in a stretcher from the gym to the hospital and then a couple days ago my bill came in the mail and literally the number is so outstanding like I'm like where how how am I supposed to get that money so I gotta go and apply for some sort of help so I gotta go do that and it's like a little bit stressful like it's just I don't I don't want to say it's stressing me out but it's like like another burden like why like the government here it's like it sets you up for failure like you're either in a credit card uh, debt or school debt or health insurance debt like you can never win but I'm gonna go sort that out hopefully you have a good outcome um, but yeah right after that I'm gonna head to the gym and then I'm probably gonna film a little bit of myself in the gym not a whole lot I don't know what I'm gonna be doing I want to hit legs honestly because I haven't hit legs in a little bit um, I was looking at this video of myself six months ago so that was in August and I literally was so lean but at the same time like I wasn't lifting um, as heavy as I am now like I was still strong back then but now like I I'm doing really good at the gym like I could lift pretty heavy I know it but obviously that requires you to eat like you can't have it both you can't like be skinny and be strong or I mean you can but it's really difficult to maintain that body so I just want to really lose my water weight um it's not really about the numbers on the scale like I know I'm thin but I know that I've been thinner and so you know I know I have a little bit of a gut a little bit of a belly I mean who doesn't we're just getting off winter and the winter you bulk up a little bit so I really just want to focus on kind of eating a little bit better like getting rid of some rice and you know chips and yeah so this month i just want to lose this water weight it's probably like six to seven pounds i don't stress over it but it's definitely like a goal of mine like i know i want to be a little bit leaner especially since the summer is coming like this is when summer bodies are made and summer i mean time flies so fast nowadays like summer is right around the corner i don't like to have a full stomach before going to the gym so i'm probably just gonna have like a toast a slice of toast uh, with this peanut butter that I got from the vitamin shop. I really, really like it. It's called Nuts nuts and More uh, Cookie Butter. So it's just like a fast carb, something that's going to give me like a little boost of energy so that I could just work it out and then I come home and really eat my meal. At the end of the day, it's high protein and peanut butter, so it's like good fats. And it's something that I can burn and give me some energy at the gym. So I'm going to have that toast with this. And I'm going to go head out and see what I can do about that hospital bill. And then, oh, I think my Gymshark call is here. Yes. I'll be right back, guys. Ooh. Yes, so I was right. Literally, my Gymshark package just came in the mail. Actually, I have another order coming soon, so I don't know if I should combine those two videos. I mean, combine the two packages. But this is literally the new fit leggings that came out, so I can't wait to um, try these on. Maybe I should work out in them right now. I don't know. But yeah. Anyway, so that's my plans for you guys. Um, 
I will update as soon as I'm done with that place. I'm a little like all over the place right now, but anyways, I'll catch you guys in a little bit. All right, guys, so I'm gonna go now. I got my Nike sweater on and I got some Jim Shark leggings on. I have no shirt because they're actually drying right now. I only have three. It's so hard for them to have like cute little shirts in stock. So I only have those three and I just did laundry. So those are there. But um, yeah, let's get started with my day. It's 2.11. I'm like moody because of that bill, honestly. So sorry the energy's low. So hopefully the gym will make me feel better. That's usually the solution. It's the best therapy. Just release all my stress. Get started with this day. Good news guys, I literally just left the um, financial office at the hospital and they are going to cover 80% of my bill which lowered the amount that I owe a significant amount. I'm not even going to disclose how much it was, I mean, whatever, it was seven, it's a $7,000 bill. Like, can you tell me where I'm supposed to get $7,000? <laughs> But whatever, like luckily, thank the Lord, like they said that, um, you know, they can help me out 80%. So I'll just owe the rest, which is not, you know, a big deal. Like hopefully, you know, I just got to save up my money and pay that off. So, you know what? Let's get this bad energy out. I'm actually kind of sleepy, but I hope that this cardio, which I'm going to start with my workout, you know, it helps me just get revamped and re-upped because I need good energy right now. I was a little stressed out before because literally thinking about a $7,000, I was like, how? How, fam? How? So, whatever. Now I know that they're going to deduct it. So, point of the story is get your health insurance because I already did my taxes and they charged me because not I didn't have insurance the whole year. So... I already had to pay for not having insurance the whole year and then now I had to pay because I blew out my lower back and I had no health insurance so uh, get your health insurance stay safe in the gym and you won't have to pay money <laughs> so anyways guys I will catch you in the gym I'm gonna start with cardio I think I'm gonna squat but I'm gonna squat light because I feel like my my back my lower back you know, needs a little resting because I, I did deadlift yesterday, so I don't want to blow up my back like last time. So I'm going to do like lightweight um, while I squat. So I think I'm going to hit legs. A little, uh, I'm going to hit legs for sure, probably, because I haven't done legs in a minute. And then I'm going to, I'm going to probably hit some other body parts. I'm going to hit cardio. I really want to hit three miles. But right now my energy is kind of low, but maybe I'll just push through. So wish me luck, um, and I will catch you guys inside the gym. All right, so the gym is really, really dead right now, which is amazing. I love when the gym doesn't have a lot of people because it just allows you to be free and more focused on your workout instead of like looking around and oh my god I can't find a machine or whatever so I'm about to hit cardio if you guys don't know I literally start every single workout session I mentioned this in another video but I do I start all my sessions with cardio so I typically run four days um, out of the week so I always always at least at least hit one mile and I try to run it as fast as I can. Right now I'm doing a seven minute mile. My goal is to hit um, six minutes and 30 seconds on a treadmill. I know that it's running on a treadmill and running outside is completely different, but it still helps you get your cardio up. So yeah, as far as me personally, like I like to be a well-rounded athlete. So I wanna be able to run, lift, do everything, you know, 
um, above average than the average female so I know that I can run fast I know that I can run faster than the average girl I know that I can lift I know that I can lift um, heavy and I know that I can lift heavy um, heavier than the average girl so all those things is what I like to get out of my workout just to be above average and it makes me feel good I like how it makes my body look so yeah I'm gonna start this run I think I'm just gonna hit a mile but I did mention wanting to hit three miles because I'm trying to get rid of this water weight that I was talking about earlier like I know I can be thinner and I know how to do it easily and quickly but you know it will literally have to have me running like three miles for five days out of the week so anyways I'm gonna see where I go and I will update you right after the run so yeah let's get started guys all right guys so I just finished running I did two miles straight at 15 minutes and 50 seconds excuse me I'm out of breath but you can see the sweat dripping I'm in my gym shirt gear Whew, I'm tired but it was a good run, a good run, and I'm feeling better already. If you guys don't know, I actually run with a sweat belt, and honestly, that kind of constricts your breathing, so um, it takes a lot of hard work to just power through a run because running is just breathing, so if you have something constricting your breathing technique, obviously it's gonna be more challenging, but I like to run with a sweat belt because Obviously you sweat more and it just kind of tightens your core So I feel like it makes you skinnier in the process. So anyways, I'm really happy with this run It wasn't three miles, but I haven't ran more than a mile in a really long time So I think this is a good start to the week two miles. I burned 255 calories. So Yeah, let's get on with the lifting which is my favorite part of working out
All right guys, so that basically concluded my little workout. I feel so much better than when I started um, this video. I can't explain to you the euphoria that the gym gives me like it just it's literally the best therapy and I know it sounds so cliche because a lot of fitness gurus say that or just a lot of people that go to the gym say that but it's the truth like this place it just releases so much stress anger like whatever whatever it is that you're feeling that that energy is your feel to your workout I can't express it enough I've worked out sad I've worked out angry I've worked out flustered I've worked out happy like and every time the outcome is so amazing so you know if you guys are just starting to go to the gym or you want to start like I say go for it even if it's for a little you do not have to spend three five hours in the gym it could be 30 minutes and those little 30 minutes can make such a difference on your mood i'm telling you that i feel so much better than when i first started this video like that hospital bill literally had me like like literally depressed it literally i was like damn like how am i gonna pay that but you see everything has a resolution and and I literally just wanted to come to the gym and just work out that little stress ball that I had. I finished my workout, like I had such a great workout. I pretty much showed you everything that I did except for like my abs, cause my battery was dying and I just wanted to keep like the video short as well. Like it wasn't, this is not supposed to be like a whole workout video. It's supposed to be like a little vlog, like a gym vlog. Um, and now I'm gonna drink my little ISO Pure. I literally haven't eaten like a meal today like i literally live off of these things like after every workout i literally drink this protein this is 40 grams of protein and i feel like it has made all the difference um in my body so wow holding the camera literally is a workout so yeah guys um i'm gonna drive home now and I'm gonna eat some food because I am hella hungry. And my mom made turkey tacos, so it's the perfect post-workout meal. I'm probably gonna have a big ass burrito. I worked out hard, I haven't eaten, so this meal is gonna go in. Um, but yeah, that basically concludes this video. I'm gonna end it off here. Um, when I get home, I'm probably just gonna um, um, film my Gymshark haul so that will be up in the next few days after this video you guys will see that you will see me modeling um, the new fit leggings that came out um, so yeah guys remember um, have a vision be a visionary and I will catch you guys on my next video don't forget to subscribe so that you don't miss out whenever I post a new video and also like the videos for more videos like this you guys know that I post a lot of content on this channel um, and yeah uh, I'm gonna go now but what? hold on I was gonna say something mm.